Steve here, and today we're gonna be looking at some more Godzilla toys made by Bandai. Oh, what? Oh, me love Godzilla! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Rawr, 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 rawr! Me dinosaur! Ha! <laughs> well, Zombie Steve just loves his Godzilla, and we have tons of product to unbox, so let's get to it! Rawr, rawr, rawr! All right, kids, so last time, we reviewed the really cool Godzilla King of Monster toys made by Jax, based off the new movie. And of course, these were awesome, but we wanted even more characters to add to our collection. So today, we've got the really awesome figures by, oh, Bandai, <laughs> oh, yeah. But not only do we get this really cool six pack of little figures, but we also get, ooh, bigger figures of Godzilla and uh, Mecha Godzilla. <laughs> oh man, that's so awesome. But first things first, I want to check out this little six pack here because just look at all the really awesome characters in this set. Oh yeah, and on the back we see all their names. Mecha Godzilla, Godzilla, Mothra, Destroya, King Ghidorah, and Gigan. Oh yeah. So let's see. Let's grab all these guys out of here. Little Godzilla right here. Pull him out of the package. I've got to say right off the bat, I'm really digging the sculpt of these figures. They look great. So much detail, and they're really small, about the same size as a, a Lego figure. Don't you mean a Batman Lego figure? Ha 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 ha! Get out of here, Lego Batman! <laughs> yeah, but we just love our Godzilla figure because it looks phenomenal. Gotta like that big old tail, and that awesome expression on his face. Yep, looks like he wants to go terrorize the city! But hold on there, Godzilla! We gotta get your friends first before we do that! <laughs> And thankfully, with the six pack, there's no shortage of the monsters found in this set. Holy cow, look at this, King Ghidorah, ha, looks fantastic. We've got all three heads, that looks great. Of course, there's no articulation, uh, but he does have two tails on back, that's awesome. He's got some really cool wings. Well, I'm really loving the sculpt of these guys. And of course, put these two big old monsters together and they can battle each other. Oh, oh man, these are my favorite. Can I play with them now? Not yet, Zombie Steve. We gotta open up the rest of them. Oh, I wanna play with them. Hold on there. Because now we have to pull out the awesome figure of Mothra. <laughs> oh man, I just love this monster. The big old eyes, the big moth-like appearance. Just look at those wings. Oh yeah, I love it. Now, of course, I want to point out that this figure of Mothra is a lot different from the Mothra found in the movie, but it's Mothra nonetheless. And I like this one because it looks cartoony and cool. In fact, if we look at all these figures closely enough, we see that all of them are a little cartoony. And you know what? I kind of like them that way because it makes them look awesome. <laughs> oh, calm down there, Godzilla. You still look cool. Now, I'm really excited about the rest of these characters because they're ones that Jack Pacific never made. So let's see, the first figure I want to pull out here is good old Mecha Godzilla. <laughs> because he's not only a Godzilla, but a robot Godzilla! Oh yeah! <laughs> I just love the, all the paint on him. Yep, he looks just like a robot, and he's tall and fierce and crazy, just like the regular Godzilla. <laughs> Boy, this battle's heating up, but not before adding this awesome looking dude right here, which is Destroy Y'all. Oh yeah! And this is one awesome looking red dude that looks fantastic. He's got that awesome looking horn on his head. If we turn him around, he's got not two, but four wings. Ah, oh, perfect. He's got that real cool tail on back so he can do some really cool battle damage. And of course, with five monsters joining the battle, oh man, this is gonna be one crazy slugfest. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh, they're fighting! And while they're duking it out, well, let's check out this last figure of Gigan. Oh, yeah, he looks absolutely awesome. Look at this all blue. He's got fins on his back. Yep, I guess he's an aquatic creature. He's got that cool looking face. Now, this is one cool character I can get behind. So let's go back to the battle and see what's going on. Oh, there goes Mecha Godzilla. Oh, he beat up Destroya. Oh, but wait a minute, oh, there's Mothra! Oh, man, they're going at it! And, oh, Mothra wins? Oh, no fair! But, oh, here comes Godzilla, look out! <laughs> and, oh, Godzilla wins! 
Oh, but wait a minute, from above, here comes Guy Gun! That was a three-way! Oh, man, but you know what? Oh, boom! Ah! Good old Godzilla comes out on top! And he is the king of the monsters! Hey, wait a minute, Godzilla, where are you going? Oh, no! He's going into the city, I think, to destroy it! Uh, oh, sorry, Godzilla. Looks like you're too small to destroy it. Hey, hey, Godzilla. Look, I know you want to destroy the city, pal, but uh, I think you're a little bit too small. Yep, you're small like us, so uh, you can't really do any damage here. Oh, no. Where's it going this time? Uh, what's he in front of now? Oh, man, he's in front of the bigger Godzilla. <laughs> I was afraid of that. But, yep. This Godzilla compared to this little Godzilla is super huge. In fact, he's uh, a Godzilla compared to this Godzilla. <laughs> All right, so let's open this one up. Cut the little tabbies on the bottom. Let's get this Godzilla out of here. And this one is phenomenal. Just look at that detail on his back. Holy cow. Yep, I think this is the movie version of Godzilla. And there's all kinds of articulation. Let's see, in the arms and the legs. Let's see, not the mouth, but uh, <laughs> you can kind of push it closed. That's kind of cool. Let's see if his tail. Nope, his tail doesn't move, but oh, that's all right because this looks like a really fantastic figure. Uh-oh, uh where's he going? Oh, no! Oh, no, Godzilla's back with a bigger Godzilla. Uh, does that mean we're all doomed? Yep, pretty much. Huh, cool, that's what I thought. Oh no, he's tearing up the city, this is terrible! I know, tell me about it. I had a golf game at two o'clock. Well, I hate to do this, but there's only one way to stop this Godzilla now. And that's by opening up the super tall Mecha Godzilla. Oh yeah, he looks great. And he's a lot taller than the uh, mini version. So let's get him out of here. And what's pulling this crazy Godzilla out of the package? Aw, oh, yeah. We've got a Godzilla now in all his robotic glory. And just look at the details on this guy. Holy cow, they've got all kinds of really cool robotic parts in a 360 degree fashion around this action figure. Just look at all this articulation. Now go get Godzilla, Mecha Godzilla. Godzilla's on a rampage! Oh, this is terrible! Oh, Zombie Steve, there's nothing that can stop Godzilla now! Oh, yes, there is! Ultra Mecha Godzilla! Wait, what? Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna get it. What is he talking about? First, you had Mini Godzilla. Then you had Mecha Godzilla! But we need more firepower, so now we get out Ultra Mecha Godzilla! Oh, yes! Mecha Godzilla, he looks phenomenal! Holy cow, let's get him out of this package so we can take a closer look at this guy. And look at this! Holy cow! He's like a foot tall or something! Just look at that face! Holy cow! Now that's a Godzilla I'd be afraid of! <laughs> He's got robotic little parts running down his back! And just look at that neckline! Oh, the details on this are great! You can see right into his cybernetic parts. Let's see, his chest looks awesome. He's got articulation in the arms and the waist. One cool Mecha Godzilla coming up to destroy good old Godzilla. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, looks like Godzilla's in trouble now. <laughs> Mecha Godzilla is victorious. Oh, thank you, Mecha Godzilla. You saved us all. Now, come on, let's go get like uh, 5,000 hamburgers or something. All right, kids. Well, we saw a lot of really awesome Godzilla toys today. We saw these medium sized figures, which were awesome. We saw the really tall Mecha figures, which were fantastic. And we've also got those little mini figures, which look great too. 
And I think these are one of my favorites out of this entire line because they're all cartoony and awesome looking. All right, kids, well, there it is. All the really cool Godzilla figures by Bandai brought to you by Puppet Steve. Thanks for watching, kids, and subscribe.